Okay. Hey, my babies. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Raya J. And I'm back with another video. So, in today's video, my babies, um, before I even start, I want to put like a trigger warning, um, just like a really big disclaimer in front of this video because the things that I'm going to be talking about today um, is pretty is pretty serious. Um, it's pretty serious. So um, yeah, as you can tell from the title, I received a recently I received a pretty pretty scary text um from an anonymous number um i don't know who the person is but i am going to include receipts so stay tuned for that um basically they were just saying like um oh god inshallah they were basically just saying like um some type of gang or something um been talking about kidnapping me now I done received a lot of pretty, um, pretty like ridiculous texts in my life from anonymous numbers saying really like outrageous things. But this situation right here is like, has topped the cake. Like this is preposterous. This is, I am very puzzled. I am very um, like on guard. I am very like, very very shocked that I have received this um, message a part of me wants to believe that this is some type of mind game some type of um, scare tactic and you know but most of me I'm just taking this as a plain threat um, I've look, I've never been in a gang in my entire life. I've never been in a gang. Um, I have no affiliations with any gangs. And you know, that is my truth. So for me to be getting like messages like this, um, it's really sad, you know, you know, a part of me I, a part of me wants to take this as like, you know, somebody capping, you know, somebody just, again, trying to, like, cause, like, a scare tactic, you know, threaten me in kind of, like, a non-legit way, but, listen, when you threaten me, my life, my kid, um, when you just threaten my life on some serious stuff like that, like, it's just something that I... I can never take lightly, you know what I mean? So, like my whole life, y'all, people have threatened me. They've used scare tactics. They have just tried to like bombard into my life, you know, by doing really outrageous, outrageous things. So, um, And every time, you know, I just, I feel my initial feelings and emotions and then I uh, get on guard. I get on guard because what you're not going to do is like scare me or threaten me for no darn reason. <laughs> like I don't do nothing to nobody. I'm on my business. I drink my water and I do me, you know, I stay in my own lane and y'all know that. So when I just randomly out of the random blue sky get messages and just messages and anonymous things like this, it's, it's really sad. Like for a long time, I didn't, and I've never admitted this, but for a very long time, I never, I wasn't too happy with my black community, you know, because, you know, all of us, like, 
we should all be focusing on our goals, on our family, on our self-love and self-care and, you know, enjoying life and getting the most out of our lives, you know? But instead, some of us in the black community choose to, you know, start drama and commit violent acts and threaten people and fight, like, and it's, it's really sad, you know? And, you know, I don't want to be a hypocrite or come on here just talking all, all from ego. No, I've, of course I've had fights, you know, of course I've been in some drama and of course, you know, we all have gone through something, you know, a little bit of drama, maybe had a fight or two, you know. Um, so no, I'm not just saying like, oh, the people in the black community do this, this, and this, and I've, I've never done this, so this is why I, I haven't felt connect. No, listen to what I'm saying. Um, because clearly this has to be, you know, a, someone black, someone that's probably a hater of mine, um, somebody that probably never liked me, doesn't know me too well, and they're just trying to stir up a little bit of drama in my life. I don't know whatever the reason is I just I want all of y'all to know like the, the things that I preach in my video is the same things that I'm about like I am not about negativity BS and drama like I've never been about that um the things that I preach to y'all is the things that I I will swear up and down that I'm about you know and our law is my witness I am only about happiness peace and love I'm only about trying to stay determined, motivated, and focused. I am only about walking in the alignment of stars that Allah has for me. You know, I don't want drama. I don't want beef with nobody, you know? And if you have beef with me, like you haven't addressed that to me. Like I am a really smooth sailing, open conversationalist. Like we can, we can talk like sis, dude, like what's the problem? Like we can talk, like I don't want drama with nobody. I don't go around looking for drama, you know? I stay in my own lane for personal reasons. Um, but the number one reason is because I don't I don't like drama. I don't do drama, you know? So when it comes to me, um, I, I try to ignore it. I try to ignore it. I try to uh, forget about it, that it's even like coming to me. But this right here, this is serious, you know, and I have to take the right steps in making sure that me and my family is protected. Like, you can't just make a threat like that, you know? And I pray that this is just all cap, you know, and this is just somebody trying to, you know, like I said, play mind games and listen, whatever's happening in my life, I am going to create a content video about it. <laughs> you better know that. Because I need to have, like, I need to have some type of proof, you know, of the things that I say and the things that I do and, you know, the type of mindset that I was in at a point in time, you know. I'm just making this video to, to let everybody know that I have received the message um, and also to let everybody know that I am not in the gang, I've never been in a gang, and I have no affiliations with gangs. Um, and also, I'm making this video for my safety, you know. If something happens to me, my babies, then y'all are gonna know, y'all y'all are just gonna know a little something, because um, this is me leaving some type of proof <laughs> uh, in my trail of life, you know. I've been praying really hard. I've been, all the things that I naturally do. I pray hard, I mind my business, I drink my water. You know, I take care of my business and my responsibilities. So, um, and shout out to the gang community. You know, I have nothing against people with that, I mean, that are in gangs. If that's what you do, that's what you do. I, I just knew from a very young age, growing up in the hood, being in a gang was not for me. Excuse my nails, y'all. They look jacked, too. And I'm trying a different um, ring light setting. So let me know if y'all like this better or more of like the bright 
white balance color that I've been previously using. Um, yeah, if you're in a gang and that's what you do, then shout out to you, you know, shout out to all the gangs. Um, I'm just making this video to let it be known that whoever sent me um, an anonymous message, I have received it and um, I heard exactly what you said. And I'm also letting you know that I don't want no beef. I don't want no beef. I don't go around bothering nobody. Now, on a serious tip, I would be the wrong person to um, kidnap because I'm just, I'm boring as hell. I'm boring as hell, you know. Um, just me being who I am as a person. And nobody, oh God, inshallah, I hope that it sound wrong. Nobody, listen, nobody deserves to be kidnapped. I'm not saying that anybody deserves to be kidnapped, but I'm just saying I specifically do not deserve to be kidnapped because I'm a very boring person. Like, on camera, y'all may see 15, 20, 30 minutes of my life, but in real life, I'm boring. Like, I like to take bubble baths and read my Quran. I like to play game, board games with my daughter, my daughter, go out and get some fresh air and, you know, um, look at Mother Nature and everything. And, you know, I literally just like to do nothing <laughs> on some days. Like, literally do nothing because that's my way of just having a good time and I don't have to do nothing I didn't did all my responsibilities I didn't you know did everything I needed to do throughout the day so now I can just do absolutely nothing and sit on my couch and watch YouTube videos and have a couple of mine like yes absolutely nothing I'm not out here in these streets you know running the streets and if you are listen whatever you do and you're having a good time and you're safe and everything my babies do y'all I'm just talking from my perspective um I'm not I don't go clubbing I don't you know my life is really simple it's really basic you know um I am praying for the person or the people that are involved that has sent me this message because it's not okay to bully okay most of my life I've been bullied. Y'all know this. I make many content videos about experiences in my life. I have been bullied from family members. I've been bullied from so-called friends. I've been bullied from strangers that I don't even know. And they think that I know them or they are trying to get to know me and like be around me and be in my energy and everything. But they coming at me aggressive. And I'm not a, an aggressive person, you know. I'm actually a very sensitive person, you know. Um... My whole life, I've dealt with bullying, you know, and it's not okay. You know, some people uh, judge me, first of all, because I'm very quiet. When you first meet me, I'm very quiet. I'm very observant. Like, I'm just, like, observing everything. I'll say my little ones and twos, but I'm not, like, when you just first meet, first meet me, like, ah! Like, no. It's going to take me a few minutes. I got to feel your energy. You know, I got to see, you know, what's going on in your vibe, and then I can see then my energy will let me know, like, okay, I can loosen up a little bit. I don't have to be so uh, introverted with you. I don't have to be so shy. You know, I don't have to be so self-conscious with you. You know, and then, um, depending on how our energies collab and goes, that will tell me, like, okay, I can hang out with this person again. Um, or no, this person is definitely not the type of person that I need in my energy. Um, yeah, that... <laughs> That's me. But once I warm up to a person, I'm pretty like pretty open. I'm pretty freaking crazy. You know, I have my mood swings, you know, where one day I don't want to talk at all. Like I don't even want to say hello. I don't want to talk. <laughs> so I'll just like stay in my shell and everything and do my own thing. But on days when I'm like, yes, ah, let's get ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Then we gonna link up and it's gonna be a good ass vibe, okay? Cause that's what it is when you're chilling with a bit like me, okay? So, <laughs> but um, I don't wanna make this video too long. I am now going to insert the um, receipts of the text messages that I received. I am going to be blocking out numbers in the specific game that, not specific game, why? I am going to be blocking out numbers and I am going to be blocking out the specific gang that was text to me in the text message. I'm going to be blocking that out just for privacy concerns and security concerns and, you know, all type of concerns. As I said, I am not in the gang. Um, 
I um, I've never been affiliated with a gang. Um, I've never been in a gang. You know what I mean? This video is to bring awareness of online bullying and cyber bullying. Period. I don't care if you receive some type of bullying um, on um, house party, on clubhouse, on Instagram, on Twitter, in your YouTube comments, on Snapchat, um, through anonymous text messages and creepy, weird messages that you receive, and it's just. It's just violent. It's a threat, you know. Um, this is all forms of cyberbullying, and I'm not gonna stand for it. You know, I'm a very peaceful person, a very happy and loving person. I love my life, and um, by all means, like the fact that I'm here right now in the flesh with y'all, sharing a specific experience, breath flowing through my breath flowing through my body and my mouth. Um, I'm blessed, you know. Allah woke me up another day. And I'm blessed because of that period, you know. And because he woke me up, I am also a lot more blessed than just being um, woken up to live another day of life. But he has also given me my own purpose in life and my own talents in this life. And, you know, my own individuality to be who Raya J was always meant to be. So, I love everybody. I am gonna stop chatting now, but this is the long awaited video that y'all been waiting for. I told you I was gonna make this video. Um, and here it is, <laughs> me making it at damn near one o'clock in the morning on Saturday now, it's one o'clock in the morning. I was supposed to film it earlier, but y'all had got this crazy migraine. And I had took a, like a five hour nap. I woke up, it was 11 o'clock, like, yeah, hectic. But I'm glad that I did take the time out, you know, tonight, early morning to film this video for y'all. Um, I hope y'all have some type of insight now as to <laughs> what I was talking about on Instagram. But those of y'all who follow me on Instagram, then you know what I was talking about. Like, I was um, posting a lot of messages and quotes and everything on my story. And this is what I was talking about you know so this is serious um, I'm not taking this lightly I'm very aware I have received a threat and I'm praying for all parties involved I'm not only praying for myself but I'm praying for those people who are experiencing cyberbullying and I am praying for those people or that person who did send me that very uh, cryptic um, ridiculous threatening scary um powerful message you know so i love you all so much my babies thank you all for watching and i'll see you all in my next video peace and love bye